Muslims have long been known for their contributions in astronomy. Astronomical terms like zenith, nadir, and azimuth have come to us from Arabic. The works of Muslim astronomers are so great in number that much of their material has remained untouched despite 200 years of research by Western scholars. Muslims developed the theory of spiral motion and constructed a planetary model that later influenced the works of Copernicus and Galileo. The modern observatory can trace its roots back to the Muslim world, where observatories like this were quite common. Muslims were responsible for discovering a variety of stars and celestial bodies. They developed highly advanced astronomical instruments, the best known of which is the astrolabe. The astrolabe can be considered to be a kind of multi-purpose analog computer. With it, Muslims were able to determine the latitude of stars, to tell time, to measure the heights of mountains and the depths of wells. Every specialized science in the Muslim world was influenced by the Qur'an. And even though the Qur'an is not a book of science, its effect changed the course of learning and the fate of humanity.